Hey guys, welcome back, and I am now here. Last time we were going through the boring ass crap over there in freaking uh, the wharf, and I know it's gonna be like that again, so you might wanna fast forward a lot of this if you want. I'll probably add an annotation somewhere here that you can just skip all this freaking running around. Ooh, look at this, a teal one and rep, blah blah blah. So I have to decide what? I'll value your opinion and place it among the ranks. Uh, if you can spare the time, I could use your console kit. Okay, so this is, I remember, her and talking about sh should she talk to the Umbarians or not. Yes, we know it as your ruler a while ago. Would my father treat... Okay, and then there's this crazy looking elf lady. I want her to go for fun. You must not... It's your duty to go. Of course she's not gonna go. This girl's gonna get mad. No, Lothoriel! You know it's a trap! Let Candy Boo get killed instead! <laughs> what if another one go? Let can this is what I just said. Candy Boo, do you mean Candy Boo? You mean Candy Boo? Of course I can't say no. Stupid. And what's my reward? A teal frickin' essence of critical rating and five rep items. Woohoo! I know you have the strength and wits to survive the any treachery. Yeah, what, what? If you see an opportunity sees any advantage, you should take it. Oh my god. <sighs> She's acting like I said yes or something. I'm like, st whatever. Go to the night jewel and meet Balcolor. That's done. Oh, thank god. I, I hope this is a teleport. Is it? Is it a teleport? Come on, teleport. Teleport to the ship. So no oh, thank god. Okay, look at these guys' chests. Um, they, they are obviously, uh, bears. <laughs> I'm kidding, but, um, they have topless, obviously, dwarves. They can obviously do topless. Oh my god, look at this guy, hilarious. Look at his eyes. Dead eyes. Oh, look, this must be his twin brother with lighter skin. Anyway, so, I'm gonna, they should have those tops that are, um, bare chested for men because they have all that crap. I'm pretty sure they should. Talk to Balcalor this way. I know where the freaking Balcalor is. He's gonna come out of this door. Now I wait for him. Walk with Balcalor. So, Umer delivered the message, but Lothar elected to send you in her stead. How am I to interpret this response? I would, if I was him, I would think that she was a coward. Because, why didn't she come? But obviously, I wouldn't go either, because I know it would be a trap. I'm like the daughter of the prince, and I would go to this boat, be trapped by him, and then fall in love with him, and oh my god, that's, you know, some... Some is like that. Some um, movies, that's one of their plots. She goes or he goes with the kidnapper and they fall in love with each other or whatever. Instead of being uh, the prisoner or the um, hostage, they become, or they work together and yeah. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen movies like that, like Pirates of the Caribbean is kind of like that. I am now the Lord of Dol Amroth. Uh, no you're not. These bottles belong to my personal stock. Have a sip. I will choose the pink one because it's the prettiest in here. The green one looks plain. The blue one looks... Uh, I think I'll take the blue one. The wine is among the best you have ever tasted. 
Look around you, Kenibu. What do you see? You see the seafaring power of Umbar, rebuilt from nothing. Where is that hero now, Kenibu? Who is gone, and now I have come to return that overdue favor. I will burn this, his fleet. I don't even know what the heck he's talking about, because I just blah 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 everything. Who cares? Walk with Balkal... Balakur on the deck of the night. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. I'm over here at the deck. And I know I'm supposed to jump off the edge. You know, first time I did this, I didn't know what the hell to do. Because sometimes I just read through the ring or skim through everything that basically I don't know what to do. So basically what you do if you are in this book as well, all you have to do is, after you talk to this guy, is... From what position do you negotiate such terms, Candy Boo? I told him to leave, but of course he thinks I have no power, so... He must, he wants me to leave the ship. I will give you no boat. Jump off the side and swim ashore. No, can even threaten me. Fine, blah blah blah, I'll count to five. I wonder what happens if I don't count to five. I wonder if it fails, or if I get killed automatically, like instantly, without a chance of even defending. So there we go, the instance is done. So now back to princess, or she's not even a princess, <laughs> oh crap, I hate half sneeze. That was annoying. Half sneezed. I wish it was full sneeze. Uh, okay, so back to the princess. And hope. And I think this is the one that where I go to Central Gondor. Do I really want to work on the book? I don't know. But I don't know. I don't want to say no because. But I just don't know. It just depends. I always go by mood, so whatever. I do know I will have to become 100, obviously. So I'm nearly 100, and then after that, I already talked about it. I'm gonna start making all my crap already. Jewelry is crafted, LI is crafted, which is gonna take annoying to max out with no marks and medallions. I could just buy, ever buy everything, I suppose, but that will be expensive as hell, and it's not like I have so much money to spend on all those crystals. Oh my god, the crystals and the crystal of remembrance probably will be the most expensive. I think I actually have some crystals of remembrance, which isn't bad, because those are probably the most expensive thing. Probably 300 to 500 gold. So anyways, um, I think this episode is going to be almost done. I'm just going to talk to Lothoriel, or whatever the fuck her name is, Lothiriel. And here we go. Hey, my horse name is Spark. It's funny. I don't know. I didn't name that. That's the horse. That's the horse name when I bought it. Wow. And there's Incinerator again because I know that's the same dwarf. Mm, this place is pretty. I wish I had lots of food everywhere here or something. Okay, I'm gonna talk to this lady. Travel to Ethering. Yep, yay! See, now I'm gonna go to Central Gondor. Continue! I said continue! Okay. Well, guys, thanks for watching this episode. And yes, I am now headed to Central Gondor. So thanks, guys, for watching. Next time, next episode, we will reach Central Gondor. So take care, guys.